Francis Albert Sinatra, the chairman of the board, the voice. For over six decades, he was one of the most popular and beloved entertainers the world has ever known. As a singer, actor, and even dancer, Sinatra reached unprecedented heights of stardom. He had enormous drive and ambition. He was a risk taker. He'd settled for nothing less than absolute perfection in anything he attempted. Frank Sinatra was a man driven by a burning desire to succeed in his chosen field at the highest levels and at all costs. His was a life of great stardom, great success, and great controversy. He's the Pied Piper. God gives you one Pied Piper every hundred years. Frank Sinatra was blessed by the God in heaven. It's his turn. We need this. And it came around at the right time when the wars were coming around. And he sang songs. I mean, people having choked kiss and hug it. He had the right. If you would ask him, to, I don't think he knew how great he was. Sinatra's words are going to be like like a novel by Hemingway and, and Faulkner and, and Fitzgerald and whoever, they'll, they'll live. Why will they live? Because the message of his music is, deals with emotion, romance, a longing for, uh, for an escape from loneliness. It deals with people's emotions that of any generation, people have the same emotion. People don't change. It may be the type of car changes, the fashion changes. But the interior of the brain doesn't change that much and, the, and what people need, the basic needs, don't change that much from one generation, one century to the next. Well, he was the greatest entertainer in our lifetime. Uh, we will never ever see another one during our lifetime uh, to duplicate Frank Sinatra. It was guys like Frank Sinatra, Joe DiMaggio that made me proud to be Italian. Sinatra would played uh, constantly. Sinatra was uh, so revered so idolized, so idealized, so talented, so enormously gifted, so articulate, and uh, a man's man, a ladies' man, uh, a carouser, a two-fisted guy, never taking a back step, <laughs> courageous, get knocked down, pick yourself up, dust yourself off, start all over again. All that stuff, that tenacity. Look in the other guy in the eye and say, look out, baby, I'm coming at you, you know? If you go inside my little showcase in the house there, there are three different levels of some pictures and some awards, but the one that's sitting right in the middle is the autographed picture from Sinatra to me. I think, you know, Frank Sinatra had goals First of all, he had, I think, great ethics from his mother and his father, a sense of loyalty and respect, and also, I guess, never really taking no for an answer.